577 Music Podcast. All right, welcome subscribers. And for those who are tuning in for the very first time, you are listening to the 857 Music Podcast, where we discuss uh, hip hop music topics, reviews, uh, events, uh, anything that comes to mind. You're going to be hearing it here first. Yeah. Live. If you don't know yeah. who's running the show on YouTube, allow us to introduce ourselves yet again. Right now. Mm-hmm. Turbo, a.k.a. Kevin. Jason, a.k.a. Sticks, a.k.a. DJ Innovate. Al, a.k.a. Al G. Eric, a.k.a. the 23rd Stallion. And that means it's time for the news. Is it? <laughs> Is it? <laughs> it's like, well, before we get into the main topic, does anybody have anything interesting that you've uh, read since our last podcast? Well, actually, this is our first live stream podcast. Yes, and we need a shot yeah, for that. That's we have right. to celebrate. This is the first time you're hearing a shot? this. Do we? No, no, we're not. No, 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 no. no, no I don't know if we're going to do that. No. <laughs> we got to drive later, man. <laughs> Everyone just shut that shit down. Yeah, no. <laughs> you got to do, do a shot. It's like, nah, no, man, no, guys no, are no. party poopers. Party poopers. I think it's a 10 second delay between what, you know, when we, like now and... While it's streaming or something like oh, that. Oh, it is. Right? Okay. Yeah, it's something like that. Well, Just like it is on radio. So it's going to yeah. be like a two hour delay on this shot because it's not happening right now. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up and unfortunate. Well, I do have some news. You do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What happened? Uh, I think Cardi B knocked out uh, Taylor Swift from the Billboard. Who cares? Top spot. Oh, for Bodak. Shit. I thought she hit her. Oh. Bodak Yellow. Yeah, no, the way you said it made it sound like she like, <laughs> physically attacked her. She might hit her in the future. <laughs> but it would no, be no. surprising. She uh, took her spot on the billboard. Who cares? Who cares? She didn't do anything. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Who gives a shit? Wow. Like news, like actual stuff. She stole Kodak Black's flow. Wow. That's news? And <laughs> it's, it's, it's not news. I can think of. It's not news. <laughs> just, just say there's no fucking news. <laughs> there's always something. There is always something. <laughs> it's just never used. Even if it's, if it's good. <laughs> Even <laughs> no, if it's, it's bad. Most of the time, it's not good. <laughs> yeah, usually it's bad. Really? No, the hip hop world is happy. For <laughs> yeah, what? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> Pretty much. All yeah, right. Let's see if she has another hit ever. <laughs> <laughs> no, then I'll be then I'll be surprised. Let's, let's, let's see. Let's see. That'll be news. That <laughs> That's the news. real news. How's she gonna top that? You think she writes? You think she writes? Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Onward. <laughs> okay. Without further ado, we're gonna get into the main topic at hand, mm. which is the hip hop honors. VH1. Hip hop honest. Two thousand seventeen. <laughs> hip hop's honest. That's hip-hop right. Hip hop is honest. 2017 <laughs> awards. They're doing. Uh, the VH show one. was all about the 90s game changers. Yes. VH1 Hip Hop Honors 2017. There we go. That's right. the official word. Yes. Official word. Yeah. 90s game changers. VH1 is still on the air. Yes. It's hard yeah. to believe. I <laughs> am very surprised actually that that's still going. VH1. Uh, yeah. VH1. Yeah. I was surprised that this year. I enjoyed yeah. myself. I really did. I enjoyed myself. You enjoyed yourself. Yeah, I enjoyed like my- you weren't there. I, w- I felt like I was though. I was watching it on my computer screen. You're, and you're too excited. Yeah, I was right like, now. yeah, it was, it was really, really you're good. too excited. Right I now. just saw it today. It's still fresh in my head. <laughs> wow, <laughs> I could read through the lies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> All right. So, now, but the uh, the show opened up with Missy Elliott. What was the What was the the show about? Like, what was it? What was it? Nineties game, game changers. That's 90s what I said. Nineties game changers. game changers. Yeah, that's what you got out of it though. I know what it's called. Influential. So do you think that they actually did that. <laughs> you know what? And I'm going to well, go. They were missing I'm, a lot of people. Yeah. <laughs> they, were, they were missing a lot of people. Mm-hmm. And one of the biggest influences, mm-hmm. I, I talked to it with uh, Kev before we went live, but I'm going to save it for later to talk about it. Mm-hmm. One thing that they did miss, and it's a huge thing. Okay. And I was surprised that they didn't even mention it at all. Okay. Um, but look, we'll get on to it well, while we talk do, about the show. If you do a show called 90s Game Changers, you're gonna have to have that shit like four to like four hours plus. Yeah, it can't be fifty minutes. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like you have to have the right people, or at least mention the right people in yeah. there. And there was a lot of people left out there. Yeah, well, a lot the, of the, people. The people they had in the show, to me, made it seem like it was '90s game killers. Damn! <laughs> a oh. lot of people on there uh. did did add to the effect wow. of killing. 90s music. Damn, man. So, I think, there, I think there was some good. There was some good, but there but, was there was but a, there were, yeah. yeah. Right, I agree with not, you there. I'm not going to jump to it, but I think that's I what I got out of it. Damn. Plus, it was more to me. Huh. It was more. I know what you're talking about too. It was <laughs> to <laughs> me. It was exactly more 90s about. R&B hip hop mm-hmm. combinations. Like that's what I got out of the show. Okay. It wasn't about hip hop to me. Mm-hmm. It was more of how hip hop got into pop. And R and R and B, kind of, kind of, kind of. 
Now, well, but, I, I think that they should have went that way. If they, because listen, hip hop honors is old school, right? Mm-hmm. So, if they keep doing it every year, they're gonna run out of old school very fast. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So yeah. they gotta have different types of things that they're gonna direct it at. Yeah. So well, if they did this year, if it was R and B and hip hop collabos, like that could have been like where they should have pushed it and not yeah. went into other things where we said, oh, they missed out a whole bunch of people. Because obviously they can't do the whole 90s in one show because they got to do this every year. That's true. And if they're going to keep a whole bunch of people out, then you got to make sure you're doing the right type of show yeah. and situate it correctly. Or just title it right. Yeah. <laughs> you know what's exactly. funny? It's, I'm, glad, more, I'm glad you mentioned that mm. they're going to run out of ideas. Yeah. But I, I pulled up before, just did a quick like uh, search on uh, Google and I was like, how many of these? Because they're going to run out of ideas. I'm like, yeah. I think they are running out of ideas. <laughs> How many of these did they have? They only had about uh, six mm. hip hop honors. Uh, they went through the 80s. Episode. Only one show. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> the, the, they only had six, but there was a gap of like I think it was like three years where uh-huh. they didn't have anything. Yep. And then they, they said, and how then, <laughs> how do we do this? Right. And then they uh, what was it last year? Women, the women, uh, yeah, influential women. One. Yeah. Uh-huh. That was last year, and it's then fine. this year is the 90s. It's mm-hmm. like. The fuck are they gonna? But before they had these two, mm-hmm. they it didn't have a, one for years. But it was like an actual years. award ceremony, though. It, it was yeah, real. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now it just seems yeah. like it's more fake. They're gonna have to me. take a few years. It off. just seems produced, man. It just seems like a big produced, uh, you know, commercial it's like, show. <laughs> like, you know. it's like who has off on the eighteenth? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Five, five people can make yeah. it. Let's do the show. Yeah. Little them. Kim is always available. <laughs> There's certain Kim's people available. always available. Little okay? Kim's available yeah, at all yeah. times. <laughs> but <laughs> then they said, let's make a show about what do we do about <laughs> influential? Brat is always available. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. But, so. um, so, yeah, uh, no, I, I agree with you there. It was There were some that I was like, what the hell? Why? Nice. And there were some <laughs> people that actually... Well, I guess, can we say it now? Because well, we're, we're always going to get to it. How they, how they we're going to get to it. Missy Elliott started the show. Okay. So they kicked yeah. off the show with but Missy Let's Elliott. talk about the host, Regina Hall. Don't She did a great job. Oh, yeah. yeah she yeah. did a great no, job. No, she did. All right. She's, uh, she didn't do bad. She didn't do, I mean, I wouldn't say great. She did, uh, she's a host. She what? did the scary, for those who don't know Regina Hall, she did, uh, I think the most recent movie was what? Girl Trip with Jada Pinkett. Yeah. yeah. And uh, okay. Queen Latifah. I still don't know yeah. what the hell you're talking about. All right. She was also on the scary movies. She's yep. a bunch of yeah. She was the black chick in the scary movie. Yeah, sure. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Fine. All right. Let's go. You, <laughs> that's all. That's so. all I wanted to say. She wasn't <laughs> memorable or anything. So. Like, uh, that's like fine. she didn't do a bad job. She didn't do a bad, she job. Do a bad job. No, she didn't do. But it wasn't like she didn't blow me away. Like so anybody could have hosted it and would have yeah. been, you know. Wow. Wow. But yeah. All right. No. We're going that's it. So Missy <laughs> Elliott was the first one to perform. <laughs> so they opened with Missy, who already got an award at the last one for the female performance. Yep. Right. So, so they have open, her open it. You're going to open the show with her. <laughs> Hell yeah. Because you already ran out of people. <laughs> That's what it seems like. I mean, pretty right, much. The show itself. Let's uh-huh. get on to the actual performance. So mm-hmm. I thought it was awesome. I mean, yeah. it looked yeah. like it looked yeah, like yeah. the actual music video mm-hmm. from the 90s, obviously. Yeah. Uh, it looked just like that performed live. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, and uh, obviously, Missy wasn't as big. <laughs> so she looked, she looked all right. Yeah. That's so, true. Damn. Yeah. I could still not see her because she was like. She painted she, she and was black all, face. She was all black. She was in black. She was all black. She was black. She was in black She was in black face. She was in black face. Black body. They all were. All the backup dancers are in. <laughs> they were black bodied. They were all black right, bodied. Black bodied. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was, was nothing yeah, wrong with that. The performance was cool. I liked it. Nah, it was good. Yeah, I'm cool. running up the walls and stuff. It was yeah, crazy. Yeah, yeah. I liked it. A lot of shit going on. Stage was very big. Um, I'm not exactly sure the order of the fucking performances because I watched the shit off of the VH1. I got it right here. I got it. Missy Elliott performed She's a Bitch performance. We just talked about that right now. I didn't like the I thought you man. said she was a bitch. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the hype man? She's a like bitch. Some such is a bitch. Some such is a bitch. No, nah, yeah. Like yeah. Yes, yes, she's a bitch. Didn't like it. Yeah, yeah, I, she's I, bitch. I was nah. not feeling the hype man. He almost ruined it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Saying it way too many times. Well, I mean, they had change ups and stuff so they, so they can dance and stuff. But yeah, he, was, he was all right. Mm-hmm. But um, they, they, I think they blew the whole budget. On that song, hell yeah! <laughs> because hell the rest yeah. of the performances we'll get to, there was nothing special about anything. Not really. To me, right. to me there was nothing special. About I mean, any of the other performances, just so. outfits, really. Yeah, just outfits, and they just came out, and then that was it. <laughs> Next performance after that was Trina and Trick Daddy. You don't know Nan? Oh shit! And I didn't. <laughs> I, I didn't know that. <laughs> oh. that, that. Trick Daddy was in bad shape. He looked like he just came out of Dude. <laughs> he just came out of his house. Well, he hasn't been doing too well. No, it, well, he's always <laughs> looks like he comes out of his house. <laughs> like, <laughs> he didn't come out the house. Damn. <laughs> it reminded me of how Shorty Low looked in that video. With his stomach out? Yeah, it was, off the stomach, it was the same thing. Yeah. Except uh, Trick Daddy had a black tank top. He looked the best. Oh. Shorty, the best. Shorty Low had the white so tank top. But black t- the, 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 if you wear uh, black clothes, it, you know, it, it covers up the gut. 
Yeah. No, nah, it, it makes you look slimmer. But it didn't, I, didn't really help him out this time. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna but ask. He did fine. I mean, for what it is, he did the song fine. Yeah. Trina came out. She did better <laughs> than him. Yes. I mean, she got bigger. She's not fat, but she's she's she held filled up out a little bit more. Yeah, she face, filled out in yeah. the face. She held up. Did she have a yeah. girl? I, I don't think so. I don't no. think so. She's just a big big lady. Okay. But um, she came out. She did her thing. Yeah. She wrapped it just fine. So as garbage as the song actually is, it was the performance, a fine performance yeah. of it. It was, good, it was a good performance. <laughs> yeah, nobody tripped up and missed everything. So, all right. And that wasn't bad. After that was, uh, I'll make him say, uh. Matter of fact, I would still even go back to Trina. I, I, I don't agree with her wearing the see-through pants. <laughs> just at a, at a point. I mean, we know you got an ass. Just we don't want to, at a certain point, you don't need to wear that. <laughs> but people was like, mm, mm. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> It's not for me. <laughs> I just want you to just throw a trashy label all over. <laughs> I mean, you just make it trashy. It's but that's like, how she on, always man. was. That's I mean, true. She I'm was. She was driving. always. Yeah. She's yeah, kind of was always like she kind of. That it was surprised me. Come on. Yeah, it didn't just, surprise me at all. I just don't just, think you should show her the jump. Just. <laughs> put, just and when you're performing, so just put the the, the dimply butt away. <laughs> just just put wow. it away. You know. She just, could have just, still looked fine just, hiding it. She would look better. Just just <laughs> perform your song, and put. <laughs> The dimply but she was excited shoes. at least. I give her that. Because mm. she's on TV. Finally. She was excited. A lot of people come up there and, and were bored out of their fucking mind. That's I true. know. <laughs> I want to I I I mention a name, <laughs> and you know exactly who I'm going to bring up. Your boy. We'll, we'll get up to That's him. your boy. We'll I get know, up right? to everyone. Motherfucker look like he just woke up. I was disappointed, though, that Master P didn't come out and say, make him say, Aah. wait, 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 wait. You're, How you got to jump all the way to that? That, <laughs> that was next. That was next performance. <laughs> That was a bad transition. That was, yeah. <laughs> that was next Yeah, performance. you just went, you did the sound effect. And you, uh, that was horrible. That was a bad transition. You don't like that? So <laughs> what's the next performance? Scott? The next performance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? You don't say. <laughs> no limit. Master P. Make him say. Uh, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right. <laughs> I couldn't watch this shit. But um, it wasn't Master P performing. It was his son, Romeo. Yes. And uh, Silk or- the Shark is whack ass. So the shock is still around. Yikes. Yes. I had no idea who that guy was. I, <laughs> Yikes. I, was like, I think that's one of them. I was like, yeah, so the shock. I was like, so the shock. Pat Mark, let so, him get the day off. <laughs> so I was surprised that his son actually did good mm-hmm. at the song. I mean, he did his dad proud. He, yeah, he did. Because Mass P didn't come out. He was in the audience. He was in the audience. And he was audience. watching his son perform. And he was hopping around and everything. He had some energy. Mm-hmm. And you watched the performance? Yeah, he was I, watching. I couldn't, he was I in, couldn't stomach. I it. No, no, I, I, I couldn't I stomach. It. it wasn't a bad performance. It was just bad. The song sucks. But it's just like it yeah. still brought you back to that time. Yeah, <laughs> I was miserable back then. <laughs> <laughs> the time when I was very miserable. I was very miserable. But no, the song they did oh, had yeah. energy. They did fine. I mean, I didn't have anything bad to say about the performance. This is the music itself was terrible. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so I mean, they could do a good job on a bad song. Yeah. Right. You could do a bad shitty job on a good song. So they did a good job on a bad song. Yep, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, that was that wasn't. I wouldn't honor. I that. I kind of skimmed through that one. I'm like, I really don't care about this, <laughs> so I just skimmed it over. It wasn't bad. It's like it wasn't bad. Performance. It's like no, it I did. Skim it's it. like doing a cover on shit. Oh, there was a lot of. So those. I'm like, I'm not interested in that. We're gonna get to those. There was a lot oh of those God. during the show. Oh, no, there was a oh lot. My God. Oh, there was a lot. So the very right, enough about Master P. Enough about Master P. The very next performance after that was uh, Escapes. Kick off your shoes. And relax your feet and all that good stuff. I thought that was good. So that my transition good. into you mean, that, it. yeah, my transition goes directly shoes. into that performance. Uh-huh. So when I said not good, you know, I was talking about escape. that as one of them. You know what? <laughs> they gave a better performance. She can't sing. <laughs> they can't sing. Every man was a woman. That was terrible. <laughs> that was terrible. Me remembering the song was much better than me seeing. What was them? They recently did a performance that we had that uh, we covered. But what was, I forgot what the show was, but they did a better performance for that show. that chick probably didn't sing, because that was terrible sounding. Everybody I was like, is this, who, so is this who actually sang that? Yeah. Because it didn't sound like that. <laughs> it sounded awful to me. It didn't sound that great. So I can't, I can't. They sounded better later in the, uh, later in the show. Well, the yeah, big girl still can, can still, the big one can still throw down. Yeah. Still All sing. of them are the same size now. Damn. No. The big one really? is pretty yeah. much the same as the rest. No, no, I was no. watching. Hmm. I said, everybody's bigger. Definitely not. <laughs> everybody's bigger. The, 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 this sounds terrible. The busted one. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. Nice way tiny. to defend yeah. it. <laughs> you <laughs> can say tiny. Nice that, defense. You guys say the busted one. Jesus. The one with the nose. I didn't say which one. How are you guys assuming it's <laughs> tiny? Exactly. How are you going to describe y'all, somebody y- like y- that? Y- how you guys, I mean, come on. I'm not we, saying that at fault. Because we know you. Oh, my God. I'm saying the short one, all right? 
<laughs> the one with the she short, wasn't. Like, she was bigger, but she wasn't as big as the big one. They all got way larger, but not the same size as the big one. Big one stayed consistently big, though. She didn't get bigger. <laughs> At least she stayed consistent. But she could Damn. still like sing. She, Damn. she, the the, the, tall, the taller one, let's say, the one who said every man loves candy. Woman. candy. Like yeah, she her voice. I don't know. That shit went away, or maybe she said she just every did. man is a man <laughs> <laughs> inside. I like that song though. I do like yeah, that song. I did like that song. That yeah, yeah. Well, at least it was them butchering it. I was like, what does that yeah. have to do with hip hop, though? Know? For real, for real. In all honesty, what does Escape have to do with hip hop? Um, uh, the, the sh- R&B. The, I'll tell you exactly the tie-in, <laughs> all right? They the were. short one <laughs> used to be with T.I., and T.I. is in hip hop. See? You see that? Boom. Oh, it's all ties in. Yep. Boom. Word. You're no, welcome. No, so, not, so not good enough. And I guess R&B Sorry, still is hi- it's still hip hop culture. Escape. Yeah, uh, yeah, no, no, it isn't. I mean, it still has a hip hop. R and B is R and B. Hip hop is hip hop. There's collabos. Well, when you go to the, you know, like R and B, like you know, like what's his name? No, there are, and I'm telling you, there are, and then we'll talk about them. But not, I wouldn't associate them so much with hip hop at all. Nineties hip hop. They had, they had the day off. Yeah, Yeah, they had had a a slot to cover. But I would Uh. say. I did like them at a point. Though. What was next? Mm-hmm. Next was uh, Tiana Taylor's dance medley. She was, was dancing time. to uh, what? That was a waste of time. Come on. I don't even. Me. I don't think I saw it. Did you? See I didn't that? see that. Yeah, all right, I skip saw it. it, and it was actually a pretty good performance. That was a waste of time. I, I, oh shit! I guess they I had Rex and Effects playing in the background. They had LL Cool J's uh, "Bamboo Earrings" leads to "Runaway Girl." Yeah, "Runaway Girl." Um, damn, <laughs> damn, <laughs> damn, kept this is Man, fucking, this is live. Just, uh, shit runaway over girl, that. different. Sorry, different. Artists. You mean around the way girl? That's why I just you said, said wow. runaway. Girl. I know, but I corrected it to around the way girl right after that. Jesus. Now I wa- the performance was pretty good. I didn't like that. One thing about Tiana Taylor is that <laughs> the day after I got married last year, mm. I saw her at BBQs. <laughs> Remember when we ate that? BBQs? Oh shit, for real? She was in the she same room as us. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and there was a uh, there was a bomb went off also in Manhattan. Yes, not, uh, tw- on 23rd and 6th. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not too many blocks from uh, the BBQs, but yeah, Tiana Taylor was actually eating. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember when you know that happened. You know what's funny? I don't even know what she looks like or who she is. She, uh, let's see. She was signed to whose label? I forgot. No, she, I won't remember that way. Like, the what, most notable is- thing that she did, she did a cover, a little Kim cover for, uh, it might have been the last Hip Hop Honors uh, which called, award knows? show. That's all I remember. But the dance medley was pretty good. I thought it was all right. Vegetable medley. She's, uh, she's oh married. Oh, my God. <laughs> I was waiting no, for no, that. No. She's married to uh, Shumpert. Oh, that's her. Yeah, oh, yeah, the, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, 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 that dance thing that she did. Oh, the, oh, okay. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> he said, oh, 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 all right. oh, oh, oh. Now I know who she is. Yeah, yeah, oh, really. she got the crazy <laughs> body, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Thing. Okay. Crazy legs. All right. Got <laughs> it's like, all right. She got that, she got that thing. All right, move on. <laughs> she got that thing. What, what I was going to say. Got that thing. I just remembered. Mm-hmm. With the T.I. Mm-hmm. and the uh, tiny marriage thing, yeah. I don't like the crossover that VH1 tries to do with their reality shows mm-hmm. yes. and this show. Yeah. Yes. Shows like this. They shouldn't. I don't like it when they do that. I understand mm-hmm. why they did it, though. I know. Because it's VH1. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's VH1. Yeah. It's their own shows. No, like, oh, we, got, <laughs> we can why. just talk to her tomorrow. You know, like, come on the show. Get your friends. Right. right. <laughs> it's true. What do we have to do with hip-hop? They I don't pro- know. Still they the produce show. it. Come so. on. Come on. <laughs> you like rappers? But that's what I was going to say. I forgot before. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I, I agree with that. After that performance, um, they did a recognizing uh, of TV shows of the 90s, influential shows of ah, the 90s yes. that contributed a lot to hip-hop culture yes. and made it mainstream. Mm-hmm. I don't understand this category, but yeah, I, I know. <laughs> no, okay. I understand this category. <laughs> And I was very disappointed. And the main show that they were uh, honoring was Martin, Martin, which everyone here was a fan of Martin. Martin. No, I watched the show. It was a good. It was a great yeah, show. Martin was yeah. a shit. I'm it was a great of, show. I'm more of a fan of Gina, but you know Martin was all right. <laughs> Tisha Campbell. <laughs> but the oh, and ahead. they didn't even know Tisha Campbell and Martin. They came. They got uh, popular, or they got their start in acting from uh, the House play. Party. Yeah, can yeah. you play House Party? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know they were both in one and two. And did you know? Yeah, I think three. One Gina. Two, three. Did you know Gina and Pam? Or in Little Shop of Horrors singing together too. <laughs> nope. <laughs> yeah, their their whole shit is all combined. Started from there. That's hilarious. But um, there was a lot of hip hop artists that uh, appeared on the Martin Show. Gina um, wasn't there though. Snoop Dogg appeared. Biggie Smalls appeared. Outkast appeared. Mm-hmm. And they didn't even mention this during the show. But Kid from Kid and Play actually made yeah. an appearance yeah, yeah, on yeah, there as well. Him, yeah. No respect. He don't remember. But that. you know what though? <laughs> there was another show in the '90s that had even more influence on hip hop. Go and ahead. That was in Living Color. And it wasn't even mentioned. 
No. Not once. Yeah, that should And I was shocked. They I was might like, have given it. A lot of people came from they, that. They, they didn't. If they, if they a lot of the, people, a lot of comedians, a lot of fucking uh, Jennifer designers. Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. There wasn't fucking even. Dancers. Fucking. If they like, had the category before, I think they already gave it to that. You think so? I think so. Did they? Heavy D and everything. I think they did do and something like color? that. Mm. It wouldn't surprise me if they did already. It's not one it's a, Wayne's. Brother. I would have to see. Or would sister to see. was at the award show. So. Yeah, that was kind of weird. That, I remember them at another show. Maybe it was like at the a previous one. Because I remember mm. Keenan Ivory Wayne's somewhere getting some award. Yeah, mm. I, be, I believe that they probably got. Where some where is he? Has anyone money. seen him? Keenan Ivory Wayne. He's just like enjoying his money, right? He's making money. No, he's producing doing, still. He's, really, he is. He's producing? still working. I thought yeah. he's just enjoying his no, money. No, 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 he's I know the other ones are still around doing shit. Everything they're doing their own shit, brother, and they're making money for he, their brother. Yeah, <laughs> basically. Now he's the main, <laughs> the main dude that does all the producing. Was of he everything. the one in the movie with Steven Seagal? He was Glimmer Man, right? Yes. Oh Jesus. <laughs> yes. That's what. No, he's still. Yeah, right. Isn't that terrible? I remember that. You just dated yourself, man. I remember that. Of course, I dated myself. Nobody knows that. <laughs> I'm a, I'm Nobody a, knows that. I'm, a, I'm a good date. You like but that? Do you think that was that, fucking horrible. <laughs> oh, man. But do you think that Martin should have gotten this particular award? I mean, he was a DJ in the show. And mm-hmm. I guess, I mean, I think that it's more of a black thing. Like, I think he deserves like, it, man. He does deserve he some sort of recognition. Like he on Black History it. Month, you give an award to Martin. <laughs> <laughs> like not Damn. throwing hip hop music awards. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, what, who else would get the award? Though? They felt no. They, they. I don't think that should be a category. No. The justification <laughs> for why they they chose the show was uh, because of the style. Like you know, it was the, responsible the, for making hip hop mainstream. Well, it yeah. It's part yeah. of the culture. If you, I understand. If you think he of, was part of it. If you think of VH1 hip hop, you know, honors or whatever. Mm-hmm. Look at how long the show was. Look mm-hmm. at how right. at everybody who was there and the categories they had. Right. It's basically just filler shit. I don't think they had enough <laughs> it's time all filler. to it is. fill out anything. I don't think they had any plan. <laughs> no, no. no, it doesn't. It's not well executed. It's <laughs> well, just you know like, what? Are you available in this time? All right, we'll just you call hip hop. What you know? Yeah. Just come show up. Do a couple of covers. Yeah. You do <laughs> like, your song. I'm not to mad. agree with you. To agree with you with that. <laughs> fucking uh, well, Martin. Well, Martin. Uh, he didn't even know ex- what to say. Yeah, when he accepted his award, he was like. Uh, he didn't even know what the fuck. Because he, it wasn't planned. He, he didn't know what the fuck. He was just like, uh, I'm speechless. And He's then like, yo, I like, know Thanks. we had three people you showed in the clip. That's the music. Yeah. And I was a DJ and that was music. I'm glad that you like he, people like my show. Yeah, he's That's trying to put it. trying to put it two, is, two and two together. Like, what the say? fuck? This motherfucker doesn't know why he's there. <laughs> oh, he, nah, was, he was having a blast. When he the people he came was probably out. there to watch, but you're gonna give him an award at a hip hop show. He's yeah. like, all right, whatever. You're gonna give me some shit to kill time because some other people just wouldn't show up. They all right, could, fine. They, How come there's no LL Cool J performing? He's nope. been there many a times, probably. Probably, yeah. Like That's I said, true. they're gonna run out of things, so he got to do different things each year. They gotta come up with different names, though. You know, different name. You know, like this. 90s hip hop. I'm sure LL was part the very four. first one. You know what I'm saying? Like part five, part six, and just do different songs. People still come to that shit. I don't know, man. I just... Don't label it, you know, fucking game changers. <laughs> they, well, you, then certain people can't show up. Yeah. That's a lot of people who can't yeah. show up because yeah. a lot of people in the 90s weren't game changers, you yeah. know? Damn. Just say part four, part five. <laughs> what happened after, man? <laughs> after that one was a rendition of This Is How We Do It by Montel Jordan, but it wasn't him singing. It wasn't him singing. It was Ty Dolla Sign. Horses in the stable. Ho- mm. Horses, Horses in, in the stable. stable. Yeah. That's a what? horrible rendition. Right? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, horrible. That's a, that's a song. Horrible. That's a song. Yeah, I wish we could play it, but we can't. Yeah. But, well, but I don't mind something. this that bad, but I mean, it's... So, <laughs> I didn't have a problem with this actual medley of songs, God uh, damn. but when they have artists that are available... Mm-hmm. And I'm I tell Jordan doing no, 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 not him, not him. I'm mm-hmm. just saying, on that dance off and everything, like they had not the dance off, but the the performer who did the dance stuff, and they yep. didn't do anything. Mm-hmm. Right. So when you have people come out, and then um, SWV did tweet this out too. Is like, um, I don't like seeing a show where they are representing us and don't even invite us <laughs> to the <laughs> show. See, like they just show that up. That is fucked up. Yeah. That's not. Cool. And they got the songs on, and they don't have them at all. Not even in the audience. That's yeah. complete. Bullshit. That's like completely fucked yeah. up. <laughs> That's and then not cool. TLC, they got an album out right now. You don't think they want to promote it? That's true. And they and have, they're not going to come out and do one of their songs? And they have Escape. That's true. Yeah. Do their song. Candy and, and Tiny. And T-Buzz. Sung No Scrubs right after that. 
Yeah, it was stupid. And it was like, why because not? Because T-Boz even wrote after that. I was like, yeah, you make a good point. Because <laughs> they didn't invite them either. And I'm like, How do you not invite SWV <laughs> or more, TLC? But more hip-hop than <laughs> Escape Yo. any day. And they have Escape doing the rendition. That's true. Like, yeah. what was behind? There's, there's something behind not inviting them. Why? But Montel Jordan, he had VH1. a rap. one he had a rap in the song. I mean, Slick Rick rip off, whatever. That's but, true. I mean, he was more. I mean, I, I accept that. Mm-hmm. But then they'd have somebody else pop up, like Warren G, out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah. So I'm like, if you're doing different renditions with yeah. different people, why does the main guy come out during? See, this, this? Yeah. is what this is what I couldn't do because I was like, oh, Escape did. Uh, what's his name? Oh, I guess they're all doing each other's songs. Oh, no, no big deal. Warren G comes out, does his own song. Yeah. I'm yeah. like, wait, what, yeah, what, I was what is happening? I was confused with that, too. <laughs> what is happening? Why is like, Warren G here doing his own song? He's tributing to himself. He's tri- I mean, like, so <laughs> that was funny. It's I was the surprised most to see him. unorganized, thrown-together show. <laughs> yeah. I mean, compared to the other times when somebody would come out right. and do a Biggie song and fuck it up completely. <laughs> Season Ty, Alamo. Ty, oh. oh, wait, we'll get to Ty that. Ty Dallas <laughs> Sign <laughs> did a... fine. He did the lyrics fine. He was on all tune yeah, or whatever. Yeah, but he did the songs and he knew the words. Yeah. So at least. No, I did. give him respect he for that. He came prepared. No, yeah. he did. He did. Yeah. It's true. But, I mean, I, I like I said, like you guys said, I don't, I wasn't feeling the, the nah. mixing up of everybody you when they're invite, available. How do you not invite these people? Like, I don't want to like, At least be in the audience so you can see their face when people are doing that. Yeah, yeah. the reaction. And shit, that makes man. complete sense. No. Like they did with Master P. You know what, though? I think that producer is probably like a first time. Like, it just got hired and shit. But who fucks that like, up, though? <laughs> who fucks that up, though? Somebody fired. new. Someone it, it wasn't somebody seasoned, obviously. VH1. It wasn't so somebody season. It was, a, it was a producer who did that. How the problem not, is, though, that this was is what, the seventh you said? Huh? Like, this isn't the yeah, first this one. Is like the, this is like the six or seven. <laughs> they should have a blueprint on what to nah. do for success. It's like, yo, no one's going to watch I'm this. I'm telling you, it was some, pr- like, the, the, the suits in the fucking office, they're like, hmm. SWV we need a new show to fucking gets no love. No, they SWV. never get brought up about any of the shit they did in the 90s. They, they get shitted on all the time. And TLC, out of all bands in the world, all groups, most, like, craziest female groups of all time mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and you don't invite them to the show so mm-hmm. let's, let's just call this like it was an actual hip-hop honor show and That's if you're crazy. really gonna do game changers of the 90s and right. you don't invite them no and not have one wu-tang song even played nothing or mentioned <laughs> no there was true. out of all of the members another of group Wu-Tang, that gets crapped on all the time <laughs> uh, all the members in wu-tang you couldn't get one of them to show up <laughs> and say anything about anything? Method Man, Man will be on time. <laughs> Method Man is on time all the time. Actually, no, he was like three hours later. Really? So, he <laughs> was? <laughs> oh, That's yeah. probably why. <laughs> I tried. I, man, I tried. Damn. But you know, you know what? They probably say. pissed off somebody from VH1. So you like? No, you got a lot of Wu Tang and tell them it's at this time. Yeah. And just <laughs> then they'll show up mad early, but it'll actually be on time. Yeah. What other song did they did do? Uh, did they do on the medley? Like, All damn. right. After that, uh, let's see. After No Scrubs, Regulate. Okay, we went over that. All right. Fat Joe and Remy Ma still uh, did. Uh, still not a player by Big that Pun. That was actually as, as much as they rob yeah. Big Pun's legacy. Yeah. That was good. That, that was good. good. I like that. I agree. Because they deserve to. I mean, I'm surprised. They admit they do They do no mention. I mean, I know we have our things about Fat Joe and everything, but they had no mention of this guy. <laughs> and he's still, like, semi-relevant in 2017. And he came out in 1991 or two. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's true. That's yeah. crazy. Got to give him yeah. credit for his longevity. <laughs> yeah. And he was still not. His voice wasn't gone. He lost weight. Nope. Whatever. He, was he just lost weight. Fine there. And he had a hit. On the charts, man. Yeah, yeah recent, recent. Yeah, <laughs> and he gets no love. That's good. that's crazy. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Huh? Fat Joe? Oh yeah, Fat Joe. <laughs> because he probably stole a lot of that. <laughs> you know me and Fat Joe. <laughs> no, he's, he's not a good person. Not from what I know. I don't know him personally. Sorry, I'm not, Fat Joe. I'm not. The, I'm not the greatest fan of, of Fat Joe. But from what you, how you, how you are on television, no, and we, how you present yourself during mm-hmm. moments of actual real life. You are you aren't someone that we look up to. <laughs> well, smack the fire out your yeah, ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fire out your yeah. ass. When I saw that, I'm yeah. like, you can't even get made fun of on a. a, a <laughs> he did it because he couldn't take a joke. Yeah, it's like you, you don't want to get dissed on your weight because it's the easiest thing to go after. <laughs> Fucking get the fuck. It's like out it's bad for my image. Street cred. That's an easy target. <laughs> yeah, you're easy target, man. So you don't do shit like that. Stop. You lose a lot of fans. Your name you is Fat Joe. Stop stuffing your face. <laughs> you know, it's like, come it's on, like, skinny Joe. <laughs> you don't want someone Change to make fun of you and fucking stop stuffing your face. Sloppy Joe. Come on, there could be a lot of jokes said about him. Slim Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Slim Joe. 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 Slim Joe
<laughs> That's hilarious. Just killed him. Next up was <laughs> honoring Hype Williams, but before that, Pharrell Williams. <laughs> I wonder if they're related. I didn't even um, see that part. No, nah, I saw yeah. that. Yeah. His speech was about opening your eyes, and he was warning of divisive mentality. Mentality. <laughs> mentality. Yes. Mentality. Yes. Mentality. Yes. <laughs> Say that again. Divisive <laughs> mentality. Mentality. Breaking down mentality. our culture. I, American well, culture. Didn't think it was necessary to. You know how for I feel. a nineties. Open hip-hop. your eyes. Yeah, but open your eyes. I was just like, you know stay woke. Feel. It's a nineties okay. tribute. Nineties game changers. What does this shit have to do? So of what the nineties? Here's my thing. Trump was here's my thing. famous Trump, in the nineties. Stop, stop it with the Trump. <laughs> so this is my thing. Christ. <laughs> nah, I don't like it when shows get Pharrell, political. Pharrell Williams, first of all. All right. Nineties game changer. Mm-hmm. Should have been in Neptune's. Not not Pharrell. Right. That's true. <laughs> should have been Neptune's. Where's yes. your boys? I don't care what oh, rip you got. Should have been out there with oh, 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 you. Yes, right tied up it. in a closet. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're absolutely right. So yeah, that's and true. he didn't say anything. Except for a political, I mean, I mean, you know, they're always trying to throw a political thing. In I the hate shows that because I, like I hate it. that shit. I like it. See, look, I'm the, my, I like politics, but I don't like it in my shows. That's why I don't like thing. musicals. This is my thing. Because I like music. It's America. It sounded freedom of speech. No, this is my <laughs> thing. Okay, it sounded forced as shit. Mm-hmm. Forced. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. this is your moment. You didn't even. They didn't think that. Oh, he's gonna come out here and say something about something and then talk about that. No, he just talked about that and said, "I know I'm here. I'm just I'm, I'm here for my boy." But what what are you talking about? <laughs> Yes. He just jumped right into it. Stay yeah. woke. Shut up, Kev. Stay woke. Shut up. Look, man. <laughs> I I never liked it when the... And the, they're doing this to... This is not the only one that does it. This is every fucking award show now. But sometimes it's more powerful kind of, and more thought out than others, and mm-hmm. that's fine. And sometimes they have like a performance to do it. If this, Listen, if it was a performance... Like the logic that's a, one. Yeah, that was, yeah, that's cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I wouldn't mind that. To get awareness up, but not But this was a fucking... This talk. was just like... And it, it didn't seem coherent in the beginning. I'm like... Well, he didn't cause he really kinda, do it right. <laughs> he kind of like paused a few times, and I'm like... He was nervous. He was is nervous. this like off the... Like, is he reading this shit off of a teleprompter? That might have been off he, his head. I think it's... It, or if it's <laughs> I was convinced it was, yeah. Because he said he hijacked it. Straight from the dome. Yeah, so if he said he hijacked... It's like... It's not necessary to do this shit. Yeah. It's not so, necessary. It was out of place I was for me. a big fan of that. I mean, the message, fine, whatever. I just wasn't a big fan of the whole. I'm like, go to CNN. Yeah. <laughs> fucking, you know what I mean? Go to go to a news outlet and, and say your speech. Don't sure fucking don't let them in there. go to an award show. They like the big hat. It's like, God damn it. <laughs> oh, the fucking. They love that thing. The moose hat. But that, yeah, so it was about so it was supposed to be about hype Williams, yeah, which we didn't get to. So <laughs> oh, they did show they did show the uh, montage of the videos and everything. And and if there was one person who represented the '90s and to be given an award for it, mm-hmm. the imagery that he had really did make the foundation of hip hop during that time. He yeah. bogarted the fucking uh, music video. Every music video, every single music video I made mean, in the 90s was Hype Williams. Yeah. It's like yeah. if you wanted to be popular, you had to get Hype Williams to make your music no, video. No, it's true. It seemed like that. He <laughs> but he had a lot of artistic vision in it though. It was it wasn't like oh he had a one trick pony. I mean, he did have different colors well, and all this stuff. Mm-hmm. But and then he did have his things like the video vixens and all this stuff that was yeah. kind of bad publicity, but it was fine for me. But um <laughs> <laughs> but you know and then he had the Busta Rhymes. Like, he had individual things. He he made yeah. artists the mm-hmm. artists yeah, he, that they were. He did. Yeah. Based on the imagery that he put out for mm-hmm. them. That's true. And it, whether that be a cartoon character or some Biggie. just big booties everywhere. Shiny but, suit man. <laughs> and shiny booty suit. butt. Booty butt. <laughs> and shiny suit man. But the, shiny all that stuff man. is, like, literal what you think of in the 90s when yeah. you think of hip-hop in yeah, the yeah, 90s. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, true. It's because of him. And but then, it wasn't because of him. Damn. And I'll and I'll go and, ahead continue. Well, then, Let's continue. It wasn't because of him. Because and belly. <laughs> nah. yeah. so he nope. actually did a movie too. From yeah, that, which nah, I was in, it wasn't really because of him because he belly. got he got the award and accepted the shit and then he gave all the credit to I don't even know her name. I forgot her name. His wife. I forgot her name. <laughs> his wife. Is, that's his wife. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, he gave all the credit to his wife. For, she was the one responsible for all the outfits well, and the everything. Suits and stuff. Yeah, he did. He was very uh, tongue tied. and stuff. He said, "Yo, this is hilarious." And choreography and and outfits was his wife. This for all the music videos, so wow. she's responsible for everything. At least you give, you give her credit. As long as you give her credit, yeah. he said. Sure. A lot of people, I gotta thank. I'm just gonna thank one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Damn. Thank, thank you all. Yep. <laughs> and he was out. I was he like, ex- Damn, well, he explained he it though. Tied, he, he, he kind of explained it, and I was like, "Oh, okay." He's like, "Look up to me." He's like, like, "I like neon." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Imagine, I like colors. I like. <laughs> she did work. She yeah. did work. I like colors. Peace she, out. Yeah. I like colors. I like. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. <laughs> and fish eye lenses all day. Give me that. Give me that. Uh, what else is next, man? After that was uh, a performance of Quiet Storm 
by Mob Deep. Havoc came out with uh, Little Kim Ugh. and Fabulous Dog. Ah, yes. I oh, got God. a lot to say about this. <laughs> All right, yes. okay. Before y'all, before y'all kill it. <laughs> Who says I'm going to kill it? I can tell. Your enthusiasm. No, I, I have a lot to say about this. Every time I'm excited, I'm going to kill say something. How... <laughs> let's, 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 let's wait and see what you say. So, okay. <laughs> damn. Performance wise, I, I always forget this song. It's a dope song, dope mm-hmm. beat. Um, to give shout out to Prodigy for. RIP, RIP. You know, for him, you know, they, they, they had to do the song and they did this live, which was fine. They did something that had another person in it at least and then they got someone to replace him. So, um,. What was that? Oh, Havoc, right? Havoc, yeah. The first dude. Mm-hmm. Sounds the same. You yeah. know. I think he did a great just job. Fine. No, just fine. Yeah, Havoc did a great job. And then. Started off good. And then, uh, I'm not going to talk about the whole thing, so I know because you guys want to get <laughs> no, to it. No, it's three parts. But <laughs> There's three so, parts. Started yeah. off with Havoc. No, I'm going to talk about the Havoc part. That was fine. Right, that was good. And then I'm going to mm-hmm. let y'all get to what y'all want to talk mm-hmm. about because mm-hmm. I know you want to say. Mm-hmm. So, go ahead. Who was next? And then, um, well, the first, first. Actually, well, I mean, I have no choice but to bring her up because I mean, <laughs> next, what you have is to. next? <laughs> you have to. See, this is a thing that bothers me every time I see Lil' Kim. Because <laughs> you don't know it's her. No, no. <laughs> see, this is, well, well, that, that is also a very good point because I was ch- telling Al, I'm like, first of all, she, th- the surgery she's had on herself, <laughs> all right, has fucked. I don't know if it's fucked up her breathing, her, her voice. She, her, her, she, her voice cracks all the time. When she's like, remember, she was so charged. She was, yeah. her, the one good yeah. thing she had, she had energy. She was <laughs> yeah, so no, charged she did. She for this. Did. She had a lot of good energy. She was moving around, but she. Her body's she, a little different. A little <laughs> different? <laughs> well, I think her nasal passage is all yeah, fucked up nasal, from all the yeah. nose jobs and And her voice kept surgery. cracking, and it's just like, yeah. I can't. She, this is what she looks like now. She had no, kids, it looked, right? It looked, uh, yes. I, I'm she had yes. Kids and tons of surgery. <laughs> she, had sur- yeah. she looks like a mix of Anna Nicole Smith. And Michael Jackson. And the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Yeah, she does <laughs> not look right. She looked like a big white girl when she came on stage. I'm no. like, you're not little Kim anymore. What happened to her skin? Big, big Kim. And then big. you say, and then you look at her legs, and that's her real color of her skin. Mm-hmm. And then her mm-hmm. face looks like someone threw like a gallon of powder in her face. I'm she like, why makeup. is she? Galore. It's like, but like that's her skin color and she now. She doesn't show any emotions oh on God. her face. Yeah, and it's like it's every time I see it, I'm like, I prefer not to see her. I, yeah. It just doesn't look. It's not little Kim anymore. Right. I don't know what the fuck she did to herself. It's like looking at a train wreck. Her performance and, and, her, is... and she and she falls off beat oh, on God. her fucking verse well, all the time, and it's because of breathing. Well, she yeah. can't breathe because it's... of her fucking <laughs> surgery on her damn fucking nose. It seems like she wants to do her ad libs more than her verses. Yeah. yeah. Like she's like some yeah. some some. some yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, say it. It's, I'm like, wait, it's what? say so your much, verse. Yeah, it's just so much like. Just, I was waiting for the fucking. And I don't skip. dislike <laughs> Lil' Kim. I don't <laughs> dislike <laughs> Lil' Kim whatsoever. But nah. it's just like every time I see her, I'm like, fuck. Here she goes again. She looks worse than before. And she's just butchers her verse. Her verse. No one else's. Mm-hmm. <laughs> butchers her verse. Yeah. And it's like, god damn it, man. And everyone in the crowd who's like trying to get charged for the song, you know, they have that awkward face like, yeah, Lil' Kim's out, but. Uh, it doesn't sound right. <laughs> I know yeah. it doesn't sound right, but I love it because it's Lil' Kim. It's hip-hop. You know, it's like it, they have that awkward face on. You know, Monica's trying to make it work. She's like smiling and laughing and dancing. <laughs> it's like, but you know, you you can tell by their face they're not really feeling it 100%. Like, yeah, they didn't like, mention her. Well, there was one person. <laughs> was there. There was and, one, and then your boy pissed was, me off. There was one performer that wasn't feeling it at all. Wait, your boy, he looked like <laughs> Fabulous he, he came woke out. up out of a fucking bed. Hey. And just walks on stage. Yeah, Fabulous just, came out, just, just, and like, he's always been so a horrible. Performer. He should have came out in a robe and slippers. So <laughs> he's he's always he's been sleep. a terrible performer. Yeah. Let me explain. Oh, <laughs> boy. Explain, explain your boy. Let me explain. So, to feed off the energy that the late Prodigy would have done, he said it like Prodigy would have said it. No, that's bullshit. Uh, no, come no, on, man. It's that's a cop out. Cop out. Cop out. Cop out. I need that shit. Boost cop my adrenaline. That's exactly how you would have wrapped it. It's cop out. And he was, he's not live. Probably Yo, never jumped Did you see the way he walked no, on man. stage? He looked like, oh shit, I'm on. <laughs> he Havoc. represented the song <laughs> five. <laughs> Havoc did an ill <laughs> job. <laughs> <laughs> Havoc, <laughs> Havoc, Havoc did. That's the energy level you Havoc need. Havoc had the right energy That's level. That's perfect energy And he level. said it. He wrapped it he like Prodigy. He was always the more energetic guy, though. But he wrapped it like Prodigy. Yo, Fabulous <laughs> stunk that shit up. <laughs> yeah, I was like, go back and sleep. I think he did fine. He did. He didn't fuck it up. See, that's why it's Jay's boy. He didn't fuck it up. Yeah, he did. No, I'm not going to say that. No, no, he said the words fine. <laughs> like, he didn't fuck up the lyrics. Like, no, 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 Fabulous, no. But goddamn, show some fucking Listen. something, anything. Fabulous, which they pronounced when they said Fabulous is coming. I said, <laughs> no. <"Nah>, that's, <laughs> <not, laughs> that's, not, that's not Fabulous. Fabulous. Sorry. Fabulous. Fabulous. So, fabulous and designer. So, so Fabulous. <laughs> 
fabulous designer. I don't go to bat. I don't go to bat for fabulous <laughs> when he performs. I've seen him live before. I've oh, seen how he does it. Hopefully they don't do a song and get a fabulous designer. <laughs> fabulous designer. <laughs> ah, I'm surprised. Hey. I'm surprised they have it. <laughs> before oh a fashion God. show. No. Fashion show. That's the name of the album. It's, it's, it's a tag team. That would be dope. That should, be, that should have happened. <laughs> fabulous designer. Runway. Fashion show. Yep. Fashion Runway. Show. That's the name of the album. But if, if, <laughs> but if, if Jay-Z and Fabulous had a concert, mm-hmm. They, oh, would, they would they would give out free pillows. I'm saying. <laughs> oh, shit. That's how it is. No, no. I saw Actually, Jay-Z, Jay-Z is yeah. pretty bad. That's yeah, how no, it is. Pretty bad. <laughs> must be a Brooklyn thing. <laughs> that must be a Brooklyn thing. <laughs> like they stuck Damn. in cement. Like they put cement on stage and they can't move. But like, They're like, working on their words. They're not worried about yeah, moving. Yeah, something, 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 something. Speaking something, of which, something, something. that'll transition into someone later, but I'm not going to go directly Uh-oh. into her. Mm. <laughs> Are we ready? Yes. Are we ready? Go ahead. Go ahead. All right. Next up. They were doing. Uh, they were honoring Mariah Carey. I got something Actually, to say it about does her. go directly into her. Nice transition by me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I got a lot to so say about of Mariah Carey. Who doesn't move? But the person <laughs> who was uh, which girl, who was uh, honoring Mariah Carey. Mm-hmm. Yeah, was our favorite DJ Khaled. That's not our favorite. That was very uh, bad. That, like, that was awful. DJ. Khaled and son. And I was. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that, poor, that poor son. He always that had, and his son has to wear like, the same thing as he does. His son was like, I always got to bring my son up. Stop whoring your son out. Stop, is that, uh, stop pimping your son. Is that child abuse? It's, you know, it will it be. Should be. We'll have to look <laughs> into that. It should be. Kid doesn't need the exposure to all the chilling. cameras. It and might be a lights. form of child abuse. The kid was chilling. He's like, oh, my dad is so loud. <laughs> he was just looking at his face. I was like, yo, he's just looking at he his face. He looked mad curious. Like, yeah, he didn't try and grab his beard or nothing. No, no he doesn't even have a beard. Why are there so many people here? Why am I here? Where are my toys? I wish you would have grabbed the mic. Get oh, off that, man. <laughs> He's always in a sweatsuit, yeah. but he stopped working out a long time ago. What do you mean? He not, never uh, worked out. What do you mean, stop yeah, working out? He used to out. Snapchat himself walk, uh, working oh, out yes, a lot. Oh, yes, yes, on a treadmill. <laughs> and then he stopped working <laughs> On a treadmill and elliptical? Mm-hmm. Yeah. He's got to raise a kid. Uh, yeah. he doesn't have time Come on, a that. thin DJ Khaled funny. would be fucking like, you know, his it's popularity funny. would drop. You got to have him nice and plump. <laughs> so I forgot about him, which was great. Yeah. yeah. Thanks so, for bringing him back up. You're like, yeah, yeah. Mariah Carey, dear God. So right, man. to move into the transition from yeah. what Fabulous did to what Mariah did is basically the same thing because Mariah <laughs> needed help to move. Yeah, I don't know what yeah, was up yeah, with this. That. Well, what no, you know was, what it was? This is what I was asking Al. <laughs> yeah. I was like, "What? She can? Can she walk? Yeah, yeah, why, yeah. why are these guys helping her? Walk? Well, here's the thing. It was, it was funny because the way they started off, they had it, it, what looked like her, but it wasn't. It was a going fucking stunt double. She ain't going down, <laughs> going down the side of a building <laughs> like a superhero. And they had like this no, music and her. shit. <laughs> coming down I the building it was her first, on the line. Nah, it wasn't it was her. That was that definitely wasn't her. Was that was her. some stunt double coming through the building, or whatever. And mm. she was supposed to come out, you know, underneath. Like, oh, like I landed, <laughs> but she came out and somebody was like walking her up. Like she's Maybe holding the dude's arm. Really it's like she's 80 up. years Walking old, up. but she's not even that yeah, old yet. Yeah, no, it was just weird. Maybe it was just weird. Awful. And a lot of it made me uncomfortable. But the whole, like her whole performance made me. But here's the thing, though: Does she have a boob job? Yes, absolutely. Ago. Absolutely. I'm saying like recently though, because she recently. she fucking like her shits were out. No, I'm like damn. She might have gained weight. Like she just might have. Wait, gained wait, wait, weight. wait, wait. Might have gained weight. Might have. <laughs> That's what. Le- no. That has nothing to do with her tits. The tits have been fake for years. <laughs> yeah, but if they look bigger, it's because of the her, weight gain. Did you see her hips? Yeah, they're big. her hips were giant. Well, she's okay? been bigger. Yeah. To, to her credit, no, she has been way but, bigger. But but if you look closely at her outfit, it stopped right here. I think she might have had a girdle. Okay, Probably. holding that shit in, but that's that's neither here nor there. It yeah, just the thing that pisses me off so much about her performance. Number one was the, the thing that you were speaking about. She did not move. No. She couldn't move. <laughs> Two I don't know what the, she couldn't even she couldn't no. even bop in, in place. I don't know what's wrong with her. She could not move whatsoever. No. Her singing, I don't like her singing at all. Anymore. Her singing was good. But the thing is, her singing was But if bad. you look, sometimes she wasn't. <laughs> sometimes she stopped, and her background <laughs> vocals were amazing. But sometimes she would chime well, there in. There were notes that I she mean, probably can't hit. But, you know, the yeah, same way. If, you, if you if you listen to the but original, she was actually singing. Yeah, yeah if, no, if you listen to the original, honey, I got you. Yeah, yeah, she yeah. changed how she sings certain notes oh, yeah, now yeah, yeah, because yeah. she can't hit those anymore. Yeah, so I'm like, small. now now it feels like a cheap fucking version <laughs> of the old song. So I'm like, if you can't sing the song anymore, don't fucking sing. Surprisingly, she tried to sing. Yes. No, no, she did. <laughs> there no, was I give her credit for that. I still don't. I give her credit for that. I don't for singing. You know, did the because she actually did. But, they did but, the remix first, which mm-hmm. I don't really know. Mm-hmm. But they had uh, Jermaine, Jermaine Dupri and the Brat. And the Brat. And they killed it. Yeah. Always. Yeah, yeah they did their they always did a tag team two, rap. two minutes yeah. and that they were the granted. Thing. All right, this, I might get some hate for this. Uh-oh. So when women age, mm. most of the time. I was just about to 
chiming like, about that. It's it's harsh on their bodies. Sorry to say, but it's really different for a guy. It sucks aging. It's a different. It's different for most guys. Not saying all, but most guys. Because Jermaine Dupri mm-hmm. looked exactly the same as he did when he bought Chris Cross out. Like <laughs> like he hasn't changed at mm. all, body wise, height wise, whatever. Because mm. they don't have to worry about the babies. They don't have to worry about the bodies yep. doing mm-hmm. that. But yeah. women, I mean, the brat didn't look bad. Considering, because well, I don't think she's like maybe she has a couple she's been big of extra. Before, but she's slim. she has a she couple extra pounds, yeah, but she's not okay big girl. Right, yeah. she looked, but she just good. from the show in general, just yeah. seeing mm-hmm. the men versus the ladies in hip hop. Yeah. Besides Trick Daddy, who's the same as the women. Like I said, most guys, <laughs> yeah. but they have all been like the same character, mm-hmm. same shape, same everything for their entire careers. Most of most of them. Yeah. yeah. Right. But the women have a it's harsher tough. harsher some, time. Some. Yeah. But I mean, like Mariah, let me say something <laughs> about Mariah. Okay, I used to think she was like well, was extremely hot, especially around Honey when she did that song. Like I was before she did her tits over. Like she, like in <laughs> shape, her face and everything looked good. But I think she's just one of those that just can't, you know, handle the fact that yo, I'm getting older and certain things are starting to look different. So they start to try to fix it with surgery, little mm-hmm. Kim, mm-hmm. and it turns out they look a million times worse than they would if they just aged naturally. Oh, right. yeah. Now, it, like, Brat, she's aging naturally. She doesn't right. look bad. She doesn't come out, and I'm like, I feel nauseous. She doesn't need a tit job right. Look at Look right. at Monica, who wasn't even performing. She looked very good. She yeah. had kids, too. She, had, she looks very pretty on the side. Think of Chili from TLC. She looks exactly the same she did mm-hmm. when she came out. It comes out. down mm-hmm. mostly to genetics, but they just have a hard time. Yeah, sometimes. some, yeah, like <laughs> some, <laughs> it, it, the fame yeah. and like, oh, let me fix this. I still want to be the hot chick, blah, blah, Especially this other hot looking like that's mm. your gimmick yeah yeah yeah. yeah yeah don't that's have tough. it be your gimmick but you can't you can yeah natural. you can't be a one trick pony it's tough you could be hot and still be talented but it's like especially with you know chicks who are looking up to you they could be like oh shit maybe i need to get surgery too it's like no you don't because you're gonna look terrible you're gonna look yeah. awful and every time i see little kim who i used to like and watch performing same thing with mariah carey I used to be mm. the hugest mariah carey fan i can't even watch them it's painful I mean, it's, every it's fucking sucks. time i, I feel kim, bad i do I, feel bad i feel bad i wish little kim came out in her green wig no i don't <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> i want to uh, see uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. oh the nipple the, 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 the nipple uh, and yeah, that's <laughs> really it's really there was oh, somebody else there was somebody else on the show who was in the crowd who looked very good uh, that was near monica i fucking forgot who it was Mm-hmm. But she was in the she was nineties also, but she looked, even Brandy. I mean, some Brandy still looks good. Yeah, they don't they don't all age. Kelly Rowland. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly Rowland looks her. astonishing. Well, she has that type of body. But you know you don't get shit done to you. No, don't get no. shit in if you're so aging. Is, you're aging. The problem is if they try and keep the same everything and they hit like say what thirty three, thirty five, mm-hmm. yeah. and then they try and change something to look younger, and then yeah. when they get twenty years later, they that look, is destroyed. Like yeah. whatever you got done to you, yeah. your body has not. It's not going to You that. can't put unnatural shit into your body. That's not it's supposed not, to happen. It's you can't unnatural, do it. man. Stop doing that. So shit. they should just. I mean, they got trainers and stuff. Damn. Yeah, <laughs> work out. I mean, I mean, they got the. Money. Look at I Beyonce. Mean, Beyonce got a little big and then she worked her ass out and she looks good. So it's they like. Use the, they use the time wisely. <laughs> but Mariah, man, Mariah needs to stop singing. I just don't want to see who's, her on TV. Who's next, man? So Mar- wait, it's not that. That was uh, pretty Oh, shit, my bad. Uh-huh. So then they did the regular Honey song. Mm hmm. Which was like I said, she was trying to sing better than what I saw on uh, New Year's. That was awful. That was awful. That was awful. She was like, "I'm tired of this. Your <laughs> so, PA system that's sucks. What it's like. it's like, Let the fans sing." So it was Let better than that, even mm. though she wasn't moving. And then they always bought it, and she was standing like they would move the camera, and then she'd be on some different thing, like the uh, jet, the mo- the what the jet ski. Yeah, just she was on. They yep. didn't show her get on there. They just showed her on there, and then they went over and they had the locks come out, which actually they got in the shape. Because remember what you call it? Uh, Jadakiss used to be way bigger than that. Was so, he? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. He looked like Lil' Kim at the time. Now nah, he looked like Biggie. But, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he, actually, lost, he, he lost a lot of weight. So I was like, look at these guys. They're still yeah. coming out together and all that. So that was cool. Yeah. They sounded the same. And then they had Mace. Come out. Yes. Mace, Mace looked the same. Mace looked the same. same. He, looked he looked exactly the same doing this. The flailing I think he looked arms. Younger. He was doing that. I think arms. he looked younger. I was happy. No, no, I was no, like, no. I miss Mace. Just let him do his thing. No, 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 no. I was actually happy to see him, and he looked good. He was killing Yeah, him. he looked good. He had that green ass jacket. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. No, <laughs> that's hilarious. fine. Rock that shit. No, I liked it. But I liked he was Mace doing his little two step thing, and I was like, listen, I like this Mace character. <laughs> just, just let him be his character. <laughs> Don't hate on him rapping. Just let him do it. I miss that. Too many politics. But yeah, then they yeah. then they went and then all of a sudden Mariah was in a, a helicopter. I don't, where did a helicopter come then, from? Oh <laughs> shit, yeah. I forgot she about that. She just popped up in a helicopter yes. and I'm like, why oh, yes. can't like, get the fuck out of here? She moves. She I don't understand why she can't move. She popped out <laughs> twins. 
Well, maybe we'll find out. We gotta look it up. I remember the dude, yeah. the sailor that lifted her yeah. leg up and was picking <laughs> was, her up. Oh, he yeah. looked like he couldn't. It he's like, stiff. this bitch is heavy. Uh, like, I, was like, I was like, you like, think I'm gonna drop her? Yeah, like she looked like. <laughs> what if you fell? Like you can't get oh, that shit. leg up. Like why can't well, she move? Of course, DJ Khaled came up and gave her some award, and she was like, I can't grab that. And then she did. And then he went to kiss her, and I was like, oh, she's gonna fall out. She's gonna fall out the helicopter. Don't mm-hmm. be doing that. Yeah. It's awkward as hell. Yeah, it did. So and then that was that was the end of that. Yeah, and I was, that was like, weird. I wasn't really expecting her to just fall. <laughs> just fall. Hey. Salute. I'm glad Thank she you. didn't though. I'm no. glad she didn't hurt herself. No, I just want I, the only thing I got of this whole this whole show is that I want another Mace performance and album. And <laughs> I want to I want to see him perform. Yeah, Puff have Puff fall through the hole again. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want Bad Boy. Back. See that shit I, I like. <laughs> that shit I like. <laughs> old that old shit that old f- and he fucking falls with <laughs> his legs sticking up that's you need amazing. more stuff like that that's this, fine so as a, is that is that everything i think it's everything that's everything that's that everything yeah no it's pretty no it was pretty yeah. quick no that wait the um what did you we went we went uh <laughs> over the master p and jermaine dupree yeah yeah we were like oh like shit crap. we talked about them oh, accepting awards yeah don't worry about that but, uh, <laughs> oh i didn't watch it so. oh <laughs> <laughs> we and missed something. Else? We missed something. I know we missed. No, something. no, it was the ju- no. See that? No, when uh, Jermaine Dupri and uh, yeah, that messed up because yes. when I was trying to watch that highlight, yes, the video didn't work. Really? I couldn't get it. To work. <laughs> so <laughs> I was, I was gonna, sorry, yeah. It sorry. was it was no, better guys. off. You're better off. Better off missing that. Now you are. Sorry, better guys. Sorry. You really it's didn't like, miss much. It, it so, was Jermaine um, Dupri and Master P. It's not a big deal. Master P said some shit about uh, you know changing the game uh, and uh, yeah just uh, how changing the game into uh, shit yeah. he said, this, is, this is how you take good music and yeah. shit it out they made bad no no limit they produced oh, a lot of bad music they kinda, but they did a they lot made, of it they though. made it cool they yeah. made a lot of it to be bad to be yes. a sh- untalented person to make money <laughs> but yes. the thing was it's a hustle though that was the thing i respect like, that, their hustle but their product was garbage what they do like an album a month or some shit like that they would something <laughs> like that 504 boys they knew they knew how to sell it locally and they expanded yeah. their marketing plan was yeah. crazy yeah. yeah their promotion their whole business mm-hmm. insane mm-hmm. they, t- they Music. found out how to shine shit and sell it exactly that was it. they <laughs> sold shit to a toilet yeah how the hell yeah how the hell i didn't buy it <laughs> I, I didn't buy it either. I didn't like they didn't trick me so but, they, you know. they didn't trick new york it's yeah. You know, the show had its faults, but I like the fact that they're at least honoring um, artists from that era. Mm-hmm. You know, they should have invited some more artists whose songs were actually featured. It was kind of like it was kind of like a backhanded slap, though. Like, a little bit. Like, like the so, show was kind of like a. What what was why why you know, like, that's like grandpa shit. What are you, now here's the thing what though. Are you, what are you doing? Did, I don't think anybody really watched. I, I gotta check to see if the ratings, mm. what the ratings were for. It didn't even come on, did it? <laughs> uh, no, I'm saying like I fucking didn't it was even hard know, to find. I didn't even afterwards. know it even like was on. I was it like, wasn't oh, a good show. It wasn't it really, promoted. It really wasn't a good show. It wasn't really promoted so either. Your thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> like I was disappointed. I like yeah. a lot of the people that were there. To be mm. honest, I liked them, mm-hmm. but a lot seeing some of them like Mariah Carey and Lil Kim, they shouldn't be allowed in these shows anymore because <laughs> of their their. Sit them down. Yeah, it's like. Sit him down on a throne or something. Uh, yeah, enough is enough. <laughs> until until Lil' Kim becomes black again and gets a nose, and until Mariah Carey can actually walk around. <laughs> Want to bumble with the beat. You know, it's like... <laughs> yeah. Mad stuff to her face. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's like, it's, it's getting... T- it's it's getting... It's it's kind of just shitting on everything. And the people that who should have been invited, like SWV and TLC, Wu-Tang, and, you know, it's uh, you're not inviting the right people. Hmm. And, you know, it's not like... I mean, they still look the same. SWV and, and, and TLC, mm-hmm. they still look the same, so it won't be cringeworthy watching them. They can still perform. So, I mean, that would be appreciated. If and, they and wanted somebody to sound like T-Boz, I mean, they do have the chick from Escape. <laughs> <laughs> but she sounded more like a manly T-Boz. Every man I was a woman. Not me. <laughs> <laughs> Not if it's you. <laughs> it's a deep-ass voice. It sounds a lot like this. I was extremely disappointed, su- surprised to see Escape there. All of them. All, yeah. all of them. I didn't know they were all still around. Mm. I know. And just usually knew. beef. Yeah. There's seriously. usually beef. And in a, a chick group that large, there's usually beef. I would have liked to see like an appearance by like, I don't know, Das Effects or like. 702. Somebody, seven, 702. That's not, Onyx. Um, <laughs> At least yeah, they had yeah. a rapper. Onyx. <laughs> At least they had a rapper. Why in not group? Onyx? Throw in Onyx again. They're not doing anything. Well, they can't even. Uh, what's the name's voice is blown out, so he can't really rap his own nah, shit right. anymore. He's yeah, fine. stick your fingers. No, but they can, uh, tribute, they can tribute them. He's around. They, they can did, tribute. They, they get other people. Before. But <laughs> they, didn't they do that What did before? you think? Yeah, think yeah, they did that before. Jay, what do you think? Um, So, 
<laughs> Here's what I And where was Ken people. Play at, yo? That's a long that's not the nineties. That's not that's <laughs> early nineties. Yeah, right. Damn. That doesn't count. Damn. They've already done that. Damn. They've already done that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so They need work. They're, they're, they're running out of ideas. It's no about work. Go ahead, man. What do you think? I'm just I'm trying. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. So my thoughts on the whole thing is it was it was see it seemed that they threw it together, didn't have a real outlook of what they wanted it to be mm-hmm. and they didn't really represent what the show should have represented mm-hmm. and if they did if they did the thing that they did they named it wrong and it wasn't like it wasn't concise no it wasn't i didn't think that it represented what they wanted it to mm-hmm. and i thought it was lazily thrown together i agree and the performances were lazily done for the most part mm-hmm. i agree and, it, con- t- and compared to other award shows i mean MTV, I don't, I don't really give them a lot of props, but at least their <laughs> shows and performances are really thought out and done right. Yeah, no for the most, how lazy, for the, the most part, the laziest the most, show, the, the laziest performance on MTV programming mm. was ten times better than the performances on <laughs> here, <laughs> minus Missy. The laziest performance. Yeah, you could have Ed Sheeran up there with a guitar, not moving at all. He still did better than Mariah, <laughs> and that's your headline. <laughs> like what? The what, about Miley, what, what about Miley Cyrus when she did her song? That's not an artist. <laughs> so I'm talking about That's like not an good point. I'm talking about like music. Good point. I'm just saying great. like they bought in a fuck? helicopter for Mariah Carey. This is what I'm saying. What, do it correctly. It's the only no, way no. to get her to leave. <laughs> no, I agree. Right? That's I the reason why she's in there. No, that helicopter. whole thing. That You're gonna I, spend that much money to get props and everything and get all these guests. I agree. And you put no effort into the show yourself. It's just lazy. It's true. I don't know what's yeah. wrong with her. Maybe something's wrong with her. But. I thought she might be it's, sick. Or it's something, possible. Dude. Yeah, Look, it's possible. She propped with out her. Nick Cannon's twins, so she's probably still recovering yeah, but, from that. Well, why are you still mentioning kids? Of like, why Jesus. is it still like a that? Thing? Doesn't have anything to That's do. Has nothing to do with anything. Maybe right. she has like rubber legs. <laughs> I don't know. She couldn't step. I don't know. She I don't looked know. Terrible. I could have done without the political uh, thing from Pharrell. Uh, <laughs> Stay overall. Woke. Stay woke. Overall, it was uh, like you said. It was. I agree with it's you. Easy. It was just. It, it's just thrown together. It was a five out of there ten. There wasn't much thought of on on the, five on the show. Out of 10. There was there no like there was no pre- there was no fucking advertising for the shit. I didn't even know. <laughs> I didn't know it was, was on until it was over. Yeah, it was, it was quick. It was I no uninspired. Idea. It was falsely titled. It wasn't the promoted. wrong people were there. It wasn't yeah. promoted right, rightfully so. Yeah, and the people that were there didn't really do the greatest job, with the exception of like maybe one or two people. If they wanted, I'm gonna end it like this. If they wanted real promotion. Hmm. Master P was there. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> he could have promoted the shit out of it. Yeah, at least he did that right. Yeah, well, but he didn't do this. He, nah, he didn't even do that. He wouldn't even perform his own <laughs> shitty song. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? You're there, and someone else is performing uh, no. your song. I didn't even watch that. You shit. suck so much. I hate his song. <laughs> he was so mad much. fat. Master P was <laughs> mad fat. I'm sorry. Master, Master fat. I Cohen. hate uh, his song so much. I didn't even watch that shit. I watched like 30 seconds of it. I was like, nope. Jay, what were we watching, watching that one time? That um, the, the hip hop show was dope. And it was uh, Big Daddy Kane ended the show, and he was dancing. Oh, you mean the Hip Hop Honors Award Show? <laughs> that was that was like a Hip Hop Honors, the real Hip Hop Honors that Award shit was Show. Dope. That was awesome. Yeah, that's when they put some work in and had some people who actually gave it. Them. That was yeah. fucking dope. I'll see if it yeah. even shows up. If this, if there was one next year, mm-hmm. I'll, I'll be really surprised. No, nah, I don't think there's going to be one next year. I'll be real. That surprised. one was well thought out, and the performances were great. Hey, how about this? I'm going to see in classifieds if they're hiring. For people to, to set up this whole thing. And I want to see if I can get the job. Hire YKC. Because I can do there better than that. There you go. <laughs> I'll be like, yo, let's make this. First of all, let's get a title that we can actually do a show about. And yeah. let's invite people that actually, ha- you know, ha- and, uh, and they're like, done the songs that we're putting up on, on the damn show. Then not, they're going to be like, this is your budget. And you'll be like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> all right, fuck it. <laughs> like, I'll do a tribute. <laughs> let's yeah, do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fine. Fuck it. Season Alamo. <laughs> All right. Y'all ready for the email question? Let's yes. Do it. Uh, CDJ 1000. CDJ? What's going on, CDJ? I bought that product before. I do. Me too. <laughs> me too. Wait, that's a product? CDJ 1000. It's a turntable. Thing, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, who are your guilty pleasure rap artists? Guilty pleasure. Uh, not that guy. Like <laughs> like people, that uh, rap artists that... I got you like, you like, but a lot of people disagree with you and don't like. Tech 9. You're embarrassed. <laughs> You're embarrassed to say that you like them. Oh, embarrassed. That's basic. I'm not embarrassed to say I like Tech Nine. Um, I'm not really embarrassed to say I like any artist that I like. I got one. Like somebody that nobody knows mm. that you like, mm. but you like. I got one. Mm. You guys know too. They don't know. You guys don't know. 
<laughs> on with it. Oh, I know. <laughs> on with it, Kev. Let's go. I already said it. Who? Tech Nine, but he's not. Tech Nine's your guilty pleasure? Okay. He's the guilty. Eric, right, what do you got? I got nothing. Shit, I'm trying to think. You don't have a, a rapper that you only you listen to? You don't like other mm-hmm. people to hear it? Like, if it popped on your car, you'd be like, oh, shit. <laughs> Somebody that you, like, if, if we heard it, you'd, we'd be surprised that you're listening to this shit. We're like, what? No. No? <laughs> no. I don't have anything at all. I'm trying no, to think. No Will Smith? <laughs> oh, oh, shit. A lot of people wouldn't like him. Oh, shit. <laughs> all right, we'll go with Will Smith yeah. then. Yeah, 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 Will Smith. Yeah, yeah Will Smith. Yeah. Yeah. That actually falls along the, that line. Camp Low. <laughs> I don't know. Nah, I wouldn't be a bad. I play Camp Low all the time. <laughs> Just that one. But I like him. I, yeah, I was like, I'm not ashamed to like him. I don't know. I'm I, a, I drew a blank. I don't know. I got a bunch of people, but I'm gonna name one. The Fushnikins. <laughs> oh, I feel I, I like the yeah, Fushnikins yeah, too. A, a certain Fushnikins <laughs> songs that come on, like I, you know, it's on the playlist. It's just there. <laughs> <laughs> right. It's it's childish. Like some of the songs are very childish. Like if you, if you listen to Ken Rock, <laughs> What's Up Doc? Like come on, man. I thought I saw a pussy cat. I did. I did. I, I don't want to listen to that with everyone watching. Me. But I, actually, I used to like them a lot. I actually took that off my playlist. <laughs> it's very cheesy. Yeah. Oh, you know what? And nobody know that shit at I, all. You know Nobody know that shit at oh. all. Actually, I got one. I got one. I, I don't know. You guys don't like them, but uh, the Beastie Boys. Yeah? Yeah. There we go. Okay. I actually do like them. I could, I could see that. Yeah. So, they got they some got, out there shit. It's getting back to the future. They got this song, right? It's a kung fu. It's a kung fu song. <laughs> oh no! And it's I, like you let me hear this shit. Lee Chong Lee. I'm a yeah, fool. Yeah, you you let like, me hear this song. Ready to ride back. Ready to ride yes. forward. Ready to ride back. Wow! <laughs> and like he's still he's, 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 he's rapping backwards, right? Yeah. Right. So <laughs> it's oh, very. Ch- it's like the the Ninja Turtles rapping. Like right. it just seems like something that that, that would be there. It's very childish. Very but childish. I, I like the song a lot. Actually, wow. you know, it just wow. you just made me you just made me think of somebody. <laughs> Who? Actually, Vanilla Ice. Hell, no, I'm joking. Whoa, I'm joking. Shit. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Whoa. All right. Okay, All right. Oh, oh, no, I got one more. It's one more. I told you I have more. There's just one, man. <laughs> no, but this is, I don't, this is embarrassing, but I don't you have don't, it. Do you really want to say this shit live, man? This is when I was young. Oh, okay. I don't <laughs> have it now. This All is right. definitely not on my playlist now. Oh, okay. But I did have, speaking of Ninja Turtles, hmm. I had the Ninja Turtles movie soundtrack. The Ninja first rap? One, and they had... Like the April O'Neil song and the Splinter <laughs> song, and it had some bad <laughs> shit. It was like, uh, what was it? Oh, out of our, out of our shells. Oh, it was like the out of our shells. Yeah, out of our sh- Oh yeah. That was beyond uh, whack. Oh my. And it's God. never been. I'd never played that for anyone else. But I had the, <laughs> I had had the tape. I had the tape. <laughs> it was real bad. So it's not Actually, really embarrassing. It was bad. I thought it was bad then. I just thought of some shit. But I had it. You know what? You just brought. <laughs> Could be the worst out of my butt. This, this is probably one of the worst soundtracks I've ever heard. I got another one. <laughs> No, I got. I just I thought think, of one. I think just Jay now. has a shitload. Yeah, you have a shitload. Of a, shitload. We're gonna have to cut you off because of this, this podcast has to end sometime. <laughs> but uh, I was gonna say real quick. I just remember <laughs> the Matrix soundtrack. They had this <laughs> this group called the Wolfpack. Oh, <laughs> oh, bounce, no. bounce, 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 bounce. <laughs> bounce. I don't know why they're the wackest group ever. <laughs> but for some reason, I like that song. <laughs> it's so bad. bad. <laughs> I, I listen to it now. I'm like, mm. bounce, bounce, that was hilarious. Bounce, I remember bounce, that. Bounce, bounce, bounce. I got one more, and then we'll call it a day. Bounce. <laughs> <laughs> That's the way the song goes. Right. I have Sir Mix a Lot, mm-hmm. and I think the song like "Put Him on the Glass" is on yeah. it. Yeah, oh, okay. put him on the glass. Okay, it was probably the worst album that I have <laughs> ever bought, hip hop wise. <laughs> So that's not the question. No. It's guilty pleasure. I no. thought I just Guilty pleasure. Special. It's the guilty, worst. Guilty pleasure. Nothing on that was good. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. Except. A, no. There's no except. No, no, no. no. There's no except. The question is a guilty pleasure, no, man. No, this is a bad album. <laughs> that's all you wanted to say? Oh, come I on, that, man. I get it out of the way. All right. Wait, so well. wait. Guilty pleasure for- I don't know. I don't know if- uh, For nowadays or <laughs> like back- Anytime. Any okay. any guilty pleasure. <laughs> but I just remembered that when okay. you when you said know, soundtrack- I don't know if Baby Got Back. I don't know if Baby Got Back was on that album. But I it think it might have been. I, I thought that was a been. single only. No, it was on. An no, album. I was on an album. I was on an album. Yeah, okay, yeah. Well, it was shitty. I didn't know that. I mean, uh, shitty. Anyway, yeah. Yeah. Got back was on <laughs> you said hip hop though, all right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, yes. Right. Yes. If you went somewhere else, then I would have a lot of horrible things to. <laughs> yeah. Right. But well, therefore, you just said hip hop. So uh, I have yeah, nothing this, left to review. Yeah, this is hip hop. So uh, that's <laughs> all we got for you today. As always, for those listening or watching, let us know what you think in the comments. That's right. If you want to see live video recordings, Why are you putting your thumbs, thumbs down? Of course. Why are you putting your thumbs down? down? Live video recordings, and of course, we're live right now. Just go to YouTube and search the official 857 music channel. Email your questions for a shout out to comment at 857ent.com. 
And for our latest updates, log on to 857ENT.com. Like us on Facebook. Search 857 Hip Hop. Search, sorry, follow us. I'm distracted by this guy with the rubber band. <laughs> follow us on Twitter <laughs> at 857Music. <laughs> Check us out. Live. And our latest content available on iTunes, Amazon, CD Baby, Stitcher, and most streaming services. And finally, for more weekly 857 Live. Entertainment. 730. Show your support. YouTube. Thumbs up. Leave a comment. Share. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if we reach 1,000 subscribers. Kevin's going to take a pie to the face. Almost Shit pie. Shit pie. As always. No. It's going to be a double. <laughs> Peace. We're getting some wings, y'all. We out.